wars in this house. There's some 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 wars in this house. Welcome back to my channel. So I don't know if this is an intro to getting ready for spring break or spring break vlog because it depends on how many videos I make. But as you see, hair's looking wild. Um, I'm getting my hair in Fox Lux today and the color's gonna be a surprise because you know, I usually just do basic black because that's just what I'm used to now. But um, we're switching it up and I'm at my braider's house or whatever. I'm gonna put um, her thing down here. And I might shoot some clips or whatever if she allows me, you know, that's her house, so, you know. But, um, yeah, get back to all them. You know, I had to stop by Bagel World. I was hungry as crap. The day before, she didn't want to talk about what was going to happen next. The only thing she said about what was going to happen next was... So, hey, y'all, I got my hair done, as you see. Took about four hours, thirty minutes, and I went to the hair store afterwards and got some <laughs> red lipstick. <laughs> I'm so dramatic, but like, you know, I don't wear red lipstick. I don't wear colors unless I wear lip gloss. Period. But I really want to try the red because you know I plan on wearing red out when I go out. So I thought that would be really cute, especially with the blonde locks. But it's, I don't hate it on me, but, like, I need to, like, make sure it's, like, lined up all right. Because, you know, like, my lips just doing so much different stuff going on. But I look so cute. Ah, I'm in love with myself. And I love this hair. Um, Next thing on the road to getting ready for spring break is I'm getting a tattoo. Ah, girl, I'm just packing a bunch of stuff into March. I'm so excited. But I'll be back when that happens. You see me, period. I look cute. So, um, I had work today, 8 to one thirty or something. So, I got off, ate some food. And today is the day I get a tattoo. <laughs> I'm so excited. So, I'm going to really try to vlog. I don't know if it's going to allow me. Because also, it's like a really open space. It's just tattooers, but there's like no barrier or anything. Like, But I'm going to vlog as much as I can. I'm really excited about it. I think I'm going to get it on my back right here but i'm not too sure so i'm gonna have to wear like a sports bra or something that just goes in the back so, so i'm not trying to take out my bra or anything like that you know i'm in a tattoo shop but yeah i'm really nervous and really excited you know yeah and i really gotta think about my placement because i'm not trying to have to wear no long sleeves all the time at work whenever i'm trying to get a job you know people like really don't like tattoos still so yeah so I'm walking to it right now. I'm so nervous, y'all. Oh my freaking gosh. Um, I think I want it down my spine now. So I don't know how much that's gonna hurt, but I'm really excited. Seven twenty. I started at six twenty-one. Um, that first strike, girl, I was like, <laughs> that first line, I was like, oh, ooh, I underestimated this a little bit, but, um, it's going really good, it looks really cute, I got, I decided to get it on my back, it slaps, and I really wanted butterflies on my wrist next, like on my forearm, but, Girl, I don't know. I might be one to know what tattoos because it's saying it. This crap is crazy. But, um, yeah. I can't wait to show, see, show and see the final product. So I'm back from my torture, man. I mean, I felt like it was gonna hurt. I mean, it hurt less than I expected it, but it still hurt, especially when it came to, since it's like down my back, it was closer to my butt, it wasn't that bad. But you get closer up to my shoulders, girl, I was like, 
and he was pulling that red and <sighs> like he was going like this then he was doing the accent why i was like oh my freaking gosh i'm about to die but honestly i love how it came out it's so cute i love the red rose my favorite color was red as my grandmother this is dedicated to my grandmother because she always said that i don't know if i said that but yeah i really love it i think it's really cute and i gotta go back tomorrow for him to put on a patch that's gonna stay on there for like a week and then it should be healed is what he said so yeah Hey y'all, so today is Monday, March something, maybe 15th? I think 15th. Um, as you see, I'm looking cute. I'm going to go get my Brazilian wax. <laughs> I probably didn't say that right because I can't speak, but I'm so excited. Like, <laughs> I'm record when I get there, whatever else. I'm about to go because I forgot to record this intro to this Brazilian wax thing. But um, I'm really nervous and I hope it doesn't hurt. It's probably going to hurt, but I hope it doesn't like hurt too much longer after because I'm trying to go to the beach after too. So, yeah. See y'all when I see y'all. Oh, so I made it. It was like a 30 minute drive from Marin Island because it's in Titusville. So, um, yeah, I'm really nervous <laughs> because... I don't know if you ever heard of like do say wolfing, but like when they're wolfing to get um waves or whatever, that's how I'm looking right now. And I'm nervous because I feel like this is gonna hurt so much. Like and my pain tolerance is just so low. Like But I'm here. Um I'll let y'all know how it goes. I might record during some of it too. If she doesn't mind, I'm like, I'm just gonna be like this. <laughs> Cause my face are like Oh my god, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I finished that, that got hurt. Look at my armpits. They're dark because I'm black, but... There you go, they smooth. And guess what? She's smooth too. Smart. I look like a bush. And now, smooth like that wall. So it's been a cool day since I waxing, but I forgot to video after I left. So my appointment was at one o'clock. Um, I got there at like 12.50. She let me come right in. Um, she exited the room and I took off my clothes, laid down, made sure I was comfortable. Um, the Brazilian was 40, the underarms were 10, and then she put like a mask on my poom poom after, and it was like 10 after, it was 10 too. So total was 60, and I put a $10 deposit, cause that's what you have to do, you know, cause people cancel. So I did that. And then afterwards she was telling me about aftercare. So I bought an exfoliant and um, some oils, just keep her hydrated down there for $10 each. So I ended up paying like, Seventy dollars, well, like eighty, because I paid ten dollars before. I don't know the math, but <laughs> I think it was worth it. It was a nice experience. I mean, I like to try different things anyway, so it was nice to do. Um, I like the feeling after way better than shaving. Like it was so smooth, even my armpits, everything was so smooth. And I'm like, wow, this is amazing. So yeah, um, I would do it again. I went to Teddy's Aesthetics. Just let you know, I'm gonna put it right here. Cause, uh, or right here, I don't know, depending. Um, Cause she was really amazing, she did really good. Um, she played really good music in the background too, so I was just chilling. <laughs> so yeah, I would recommend 10 out of 10, really good. And um, today is probably like the final day I'm, I'm videoing me getting ready for spring break because I'm getting my nails done. I'm so excited. Like, I'm so excited. I just love when my nails are done. You just really get like a different aura. You know, females, us girls, we know. When our hair is done or when our nails get done, it's really something, it's really something about it. Don't know how to act. And I don't know how to act. Okay, okay. So, um, I don't wanna be recording a lot cause I'm probably gonna be in the nail shop. I don't know. But, um, yeah, I'll show y'all the finished product. So I got my nails done. 
get into it i'm gonna put a clip um probably like right here or whatever of what the nails i wanted to look like um they came out really cute honestly i added like the jewels to well she added but i told her to add the jewels too to them too just to add a little more and um she did really good it was 80 dollars for it and then i tipped her 10 because she actually did amazing I don't know if they're worth eighty dollars, but I paid it because you know it just costs to be a bad B. It does. So here I am. Yeah. It took about two hours. Honestly, love them though. They're very cute. Red because they're gonna match my club outfit. Mm, a weight on it. Anyway, thanks for watching this video. <laughs> like, comment, and subscribe, and tune into my next video of actual spring break. It's going to be a movie. I'm going to have a blast. I can't wait.